Hi, guys. We're live with the cast of The Flash. Um, we have some questions for you. So, first one. Who do you think has more fun on your show, the heroes or the villains? Ooh. I personally think the villains have I think more the villains fun. Too. Yeah, the villains are lucky. They get to, like, come in and be badass and leave. Yeah. Oh, I wonder if I can't curse. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry ass. about that. Yeah. I think you can say ass. I think the villains definitely get to have more fun. Like, everyone wants to be a bad guy. It's such a departure from maybe who we are in our real lives, so it's fun to get on set and, and play mm -hmm. that. I don't get to, obviously, but I <laughs> so, envy the people that do. Yeah. <laughs> and we, we get to, like, uh, touch on, like, traditional superhero characteristics, so, like, you get bad guys saying cool one-liner puns, mm -hmm. and who doesn't like that? Love it. We get some good puns. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so what was your most memorable moment on set from the last season? There's too many. Yeah. There's a lot. Uh, I just remember, like, being close to rapping and having, like, this really huge, like, dinner. Ugh, it was just, like, really nice. It, like, made it feel like we're, like, doing the show together. Yeah. We're, like, yeah, and we're, we're do making good TV. Yeah. A lot of them are moments that <coughs> I remember were, like, offset when we'd be hanging out at Jesse's and, like, mm -hmm. having family dinner and, like, having a good time. Mm -hmm. I'm a big fan of the card games we play. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we play asshole and well, Uno. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> the, the PG thirteen guys. Yeah. Sorry, uh, and Uno. And Uno, yeah. I know that's some of my favorites. Is like hanging out. Yeah. Well, uh, Danielle, Caitlin let loose a little bit with the karaoke in season one. Yeah. What are her other secret talents? Well, clearly not karaoke. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I feel like Caitlin's probably like a really good organizer. Stewart? Yeah, probably. Yeah. She, yeah, she's a little OCD. Like, yeah, um, that wouldn't surprise me. Like, I don't know. Caitlin's no arts and crafts. Probably. <laughs> she, she's got <laughs> like a YouTube channel. Exactly, or like her own Pinterest page, <laughs> like DIY. <laughs> That's awesome. Love it. Um, Candace, you've gotten some great feedback from young girls. Glad to see themselves reflect reflected in a character like Iris. What does this mean for you? It means a lot to even be a part of a shift in television where young girls get to see themselves as not only leading ladies, but romantic interests, um, strong, powerful. We need to see more of that. And it's not just about um, African Americans, about, it's about Asians and Hispanics. We all want to see ourselves represented on TV as powerful, strong people. So for me to even have the opportunity, it's amazing. I see you, girl. Yeah. I see you. Mm -hmm. So with Carlos, Cisco was noticing abilities of his own at the end of season one. What kind of powers do you hope he gets? And how do you want him to help Barry further in season two? Um, Wow, <laughs> that's a good question. question. Yeah. Um, I, I hope, I mean, I tend to like the powers that are like weaponized, you know what I mean? And require like crazy visual effects because like who doesn't want to see themselves with like crazy visual effects? Um, so I, ho I hope there's some visual effects in my future in some capacity. I don't know why, um, but uh, yeah. And of course, like because this goes so close to Barry and like, it, he's fundamentally like his part of his support team. Um, I, yeah, I think it would make sense for it to be like in support of Barry's like flash heroism. Awesome. Um, so this is for all of you guys. If you could play, pick any character besides your own to play, who would it be and why? That, that's too tough. <laughs> no answer. Um, uh, uh, Doctor Wells. Yeah, yeah, he's up there. Mm -hmm. Or Grodd. Can I even do yeah, that? I was gonna say, <laughs> you can. Okay. Grodd's an awesome want. one. Love it. Um, so we'll just do one more, I think. Um, what last question here at Comic Con? What is in your survival kit? How are you guys surviving down here? Ooh, lots of water. Yeah, water. Water's Stay a big hydrated. One. Mm -hmm. Little Listerine strips. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Deodorant. Backup mm -hmm. phone charger. Mm -hmm. Sleeping tweet. Yeah. Meerkat and all that good stuff. Yeah, you, you know. Well, thank you guys. You want to say bye to your Meerkat fans? Bye. 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 <laughs>